all at one time. And and that could be a big mistake when you find yourself out here dating and you're giving all of yourself away too soon. You don't want to do that. So, yeah, I think it should be, you know, there are some things that you're going to have to talk about that you went through. But there's always that timing there. You got to make sure that it's God's timing and it's not your human nature, a.k.a. flesh, <laughs> wanting to prove a point to whoever you're with. You know, sometimes ladies want to prove a point where this is what I did. That's when blah, blah, blah. No. It's got to be God's time, and it can't be your flesh. It can't be a flesh moment to reveal something. Like, you can't reveal what you done did in your past in the heat of the moment. You know, if you're having an argument, it could it could turn, you know, bad. You can ruin a good relationship by bringing things out too soon. Um, a person may not be ready for all that. So, again, it goes back to God's timing. You got to keep praying on it. All right, next. Y'all, I'm enjoying this Q&A session. We got... Two minutes left here. Okay, let me see, let me see, let me see. Um, I'm going down this thing, finding more questions, more questions. Okay. Oh, this is another question for me. What always makes you laugh? Anything stupid? <laughs> no, nah, but for real, um, the things that make me laugh are just people being themselves. Because you wouldn't believe how much humor we really have when we just be ourselves. Sometimes we might say words wrong. Sometimes we might walk <laughs> funny or something. You know, when people just be themselves, you know, that makes me laugh a lot. When And especially, I love comedy movies. Um, I do watch a lot of comedy movies. But uh, just about anything can make me laugh, though. I mean, really, I'm not that hard to, to find. It's not that hard to find my joy. Trust me. But, yeah, that can make me laugh. All right, y'all. So, I thank y'all so much. We don't have time for another question. But I hope I was able to answer y'all's questions and maybe give you some sense of direction that you can go. Don't forget to check out those women and gentlemen on Facebook. Um... Dr. Les Carter, that's L-E-S, Dr. Helen, Helen Sadler, and also Dr. Carmen Bryant. You can always go on there and check out what they're saying for these relationships, especially if you've dealt with a relationship with ghost lightning and all that stuff. They break it down really good. Also, don't let me forget Susan Winters. You can check Susan Winters out on YouTube, y'all, and Facebook. She's really great. She wrote for the New York Times. Um, she's a good, good friend, um, the New York Times, and also she's been on Oprah Winfrey. So y'all go check out these names, you know, start learning some different stuff. All right. So thank y'all so much for listening to Key Advancement with Miss Coco Bowden. <laughs>